Hi there, I'm Jeff Watts and I've been lucky enough to work with thousands of Agile teams over the years in all sorts of industries from gaming to pharmaceuticals, from banking to telecoms, from startups to FTSE 100 companies and pretty much anything in between. And one thing that all of these completely different contexts have in common is the importance of the product owner role. This role, the champion of the product, the person who's tasked with delighting customers and maximizing return on investment is without question an incredibly tough one. And the number one complaint I hear from Agile teams is they don't see enough of their product owner. But equally, the number one complaint I hear from product owners is that there aren't enough hours in the day. Product owners need to understand the Scrum framework and of course, all of the principles of Agile development and they're going to need to become proficient in a number of formal and informal product management techniques. That's a given. And there are plenty of courses out there that can help you with that. Now, while this knowledge is essential, it's not enough. Because I've seen loads of product owners who have all that knowledge, they know Scrum, they know product management techniques, but still many of them wouldn't be considered successful. The difference between the good product owners and the great product owners is how they handle the psychological and the people related aspects of the role. Making decisions with incomplete information because we're never going to know everything. Being ruthless enough to focus on what's really important and getting feedback early. Taking the time to get informed about the stakeholders and the development team. Developing a versatility in your leadership style based on the context and the people you're attempting to lead. Great product owners know they can't do everything themselves, so they empower and nurture collaboration with other people, while also increasing their own levels of empowerment. And of course, there's negotiation necessary with so many people with an opinion and desires. Learning the psychological and the people side of the product owner role isn't easy, I grant you, but this is my specialism and I'm going to guide you into a greater understanding of your mindset, your thought patterns, your biases and your strengths. I'll help you understand why some aspects of being a product owner are more difficult than others and give you practical tools to help you master yourself. You are going to build amazing products. You're going to lead a more product focused organization. You're going to delight your customers and build a fulfilling relationship with your team. Sure, of course, you could do just fine as a good product owner, but why settle for good when you can join me on this course and become a great product owner?